Yo, what's good? It's your boy Tiger here. Tiger Woods, that is. You feel me? And I'm about to show you what I'm about to do. What, I, what am I doing? Oh, but you see by the title, I'm about to show you my monthly pickups for the month of August. You feel me? I didn't really get many things throughout the month. You feel me? But I did pick up a few things just browsing on the internet. So without further ado, let's dive in now. You feel me? And let's see what I got. And don't forget, peek, peek the drip. Well, hold on, peep the, peep the drip. Y'all can see the back? Peep the drip. Peep the drip. Peep. One of the very first things I purchased this month, you feel me? I saw a dude posted on Instagram, and I'm like, man, I'm hard, you feel me? So I messaged him, I got him, you feel me? Now we're here. So these are some 2005 Dose and Gambana Palm Jeans. Um, I, When I saw these, bro, I'm like, bro, they are like crazy, you feel me? What really drew me to them is the distressing, and then you see like the palm within the... But then the distressing, I feel like, man, that was so hard, you feel me? These jeans cost me three twenty. you know what I mean? Pretty, like, pretty pricey for sure. Um, they have, like, a kind of like a slim baggy fit to it. Uh, and I kind of like that, you feel me? I might throw it on with this shirt. Now, 320 is, like, a little expensive, you know? Especially since I'm trying to budget right now and build up my wardrobe. But, like, I feel these jeans, like, one of them pieces that, like, you just come across and, like, you just got to copy, you feel me? So, the, what the palms say? The why do wake up? Do you she not young? She drink the day? Hold on. All right, the poem I'm reading don't really make sense because I don't know what they trying to say. Maybe I'm tripping. This ain't really no poem. Why do you wake up? Do you she we not young? She drink. The day. I don't even know what that means, my boy. But he, bro, I got all this shit, boy. <laughs> so these next three pair of jeans I'm gonna show you, you already know why I got these from. The Thrift. These are some Polo Ralph Lauren denim, you feel me? And I really like the wash of these jeans. And it came with the discretion by the knees, you feel me? It came with the discretion by the knees, you feel me? So that's what like, I think when I picked them up, that's what really drew me to them. I think actually when I was walking down the aisle, I think this is the first thing I saw because I, I saw the leg kind of like sticking out and I was like, oh, discretion. Like, let me just check it out real quick. And it happened to be these lemon baggy fit too, you feel me? I wore these in my last video, how to, what up? How to find your style, you know what I mean? I was wearing these jeans um, and I really like these jeans. I really like the fit of these jeans. Uh, I like the color of these jeans. I think right now, this probably be one of my favorite pair of jeans, you feel me? So I think I paid fifth, either between 10 to $15 I paid for these jeans, you feel me? So I really feel like I came up with this. They even have like some slight discretion at the bottom as well. Like you seen my last video with the thrift haul and the other two blue jeans and how they fit. I actually wanted them to fit exactly like this, you know? So it's like when I tried them on in the video, I really didn't like it. So since I didn't like it, I'm really gonna be selling them because like I like my jeans to fit like this. And those jeans, they fit like a real, they fit slimmer and it was like real kind of exact on my waist and I didn't really like that, you know? So if I could have all my jeans to fit like this, I definitely would do that. Now these next two pair of jeans, they not true. I didn't get these from your traditional like thrift stores. These actually came from like a, a thrift consignment type store, you feel me, where like, you know, they sell all type of stuff in there, you feel me? And different price ranges rather than like, you know, going to the thrift and everything being like 10 to $15, you feel me? So these two jeans actually was $25 a piece, but dude actually gave them to me for $20 a piece, you know what I mean? So the very first pair, these pair are a pair of Levi's and these pair are a pair of Calvin Klein. Now they're both a uh, wide fit, you know, because they like some vintage jeans. The only difference is between the two, these are more of a, the Calvin Klein is a little bit more faded, um, where the Levi's is a little bit more, you still see that, like that black dark denim on it, which I really like, you know, and they're really like a loose fit, like I said. It's just the Calvin Klein, they fit like a little bit more exact up on the waist, and I don't like that. Um, even though they are 34, I think by them being like, uh, older pair of jeans like they probably shrunk throughout the years so i really don't like how they fit on my waist so i probably end up selling these um and end up keeping these you know so these levi's though crazy these are some wide pants low-key look like an ironing board for sure but these pants really fire you know i ain't gonna lie to you as i proceed to give you what you need i was on ebay and i had to pick up these you feel me 
uh obviously vintage tommy hilfiger i really love tommy hilfiger uh that was one of my favorite brands as i was growing up you know um and when i saw this shirt it just kind of gave me like that that old kind of 90s feel you feel me or early 2000s you know if you look at like them older sitcoms and stuff they always had like some like stripes on you feel me and it was like collar shirts so when i saw this um it kind of gave me that feel and that's the kind of look i was going for when i'm wearing this shirt um and i only got this shirt for eight dollars off of ebay you feel me so i had to scoop this up um and i just i love it you feel me like they got like a little mark at the bottom but other than that like shirt like i feel like in a cool condition a little bit faded but i like it you know so i really don't remember how i came across this i think i was just looking for like a vest to wear you know um and i I think i typed in camo camo vest while i was on ebay and i came across this one and i'm like bro when i saw it i'm like that's so fire i just added it to my watch list i didn't even really plan on buying it anytime soon but then like you know i had got like a little special offer from the seller so i was like Oh, that's how you feeling? Let me get that up out you, you feel me? So I didn't got this vest right here. Camouflage, real treat camouflage. I didn't got this vest for $18 off of eBay. Um, a little bit more than I was I wanted to pay, but I'm like $18 is not bad. And it got some pockets on it. Uh I just plan I don't plan on actually wearing this like with an outfit. I really plan on wearing this when I start like my other videos, my sewing videos. And I think this like would be a cool little, like a little work type uh vest I'll be wearing. And then like, you know, it just, it's kind of look cool. We got pockets, so I could just put stuff in it as well. Last top I got, it is a denim jean jacket, of course, Levi's. The only thing I hate about this, bro, like usually like with all my jackets, I, I buy them in a size large, you know? So I bought this in a size large, but it fit big and it fit weird. And I hate that. Like I could have returned it, um, but I just was like, I don't want to go through that hassle of returning it. And then them having to wait to get my money back and then having to reorder it again and wait for it to come out. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to just keep the large. Um, this is a really like the jean jacket is actually like a really cool jacket. Like the pockets on it is like pretty cool. Um, I actually saw some dude I follow. I don't know him. Some dude I follow. One of his friends in the picture was wearing this jean jacket. And I'm like. Bro, that's so fire, you feel me? So he tagged his friend. I went to his friend page. I'm just looking. I can't find it, you feel me? So like, I saw him wearing it, this jacket in another picture. So I zoomed in, saw it was Levi's. I typed in Levi's. I typed in jean jacket, uh, one pocket Levi, you know? So, um, and then I was able to find it on Zappos or something like that. And it was like, how much is it? Oh, the original price is $108, but I got it for like half that. So I got this jacket for $50, you know, so um, that's how I found this jacket. Uh, hopefully, I'm, I'm probably going to buy another one and buy a medium and then sell this one. Uh, but yeah, I feel like, like I said in the last essential video, I feel like um, having like a nice jean jacket within your wardrobe is definitely essential, you feel me? So I feel like I had to pick up another jean jacket because I only have my that one Harley Davidson one I have. So if you watch my essentials video, um... You know, it was two pair of shoes that I said I was going to be get copping real soon. So the Converse 70, I did get those, but they didn't come in yet. You know, so by the time I do my next video, hopefully they in. And also, when I was going to be buying like the uh, Vivian Westwood Asics, I went to go buy them. I went on GOAT. I'm looking for my size because when, when I made that video, they had them. And they had them for $436 in my size and a size 9. So I went on the website. I'm about to go buy them. And the size 9 is gone. They only got a size like eight or eight and a half, something like that. And for some reason, somebody's trying to sell them for like 2000 I don't understand that, you know? So I'm like, you know what? Don't even worry about it, you feel me? So while I was on eBay, once again, I came across these shoes. I had typed in some Flame Vans because I had Flame Vans a long time, a little minute ago, but uh, I don't know what happened to them. So I came across these. And when I came across these, I have never seen these Vans before. I saw Flame Vans, but I never saw these. So when I saw them, I'm like, bro, these are hard. I added them to my watch list and I think they was under $100. I really think I paid like, I don't even think I paid $60 for these. I think I paid around like 45 or something plus shipping. Um, and I'm like, bro, these are like, boy, what? These, like they, they very simple, they very plain, but they so hard. Like I feel like that flame just added like that, that oomph to it, you feel me? 
uh, with the gum bottom so I feel like the gum bottom so like really like set it off like I don't know something about that gum bottom so like just so fire you feel me and then obviously the flame on the side is like the hardest part so I was like need that I need that I don't remember exactly where I originally saw these at but I knew I wanted it when I first saw them and then I saw them on Depop uh, for sale in my size. And I was like, you know what? Let me just pick these up because I wanted them anyway. Um, and it was like half off from like the original price. Obviously, they was pre-owned, but they still in good condition. It was these Converse, but they got like this paint splatter like kind of effect on it. Um, and I think these was like really like clean. I don't think I'm gonna do like the, it's like a low key, like a brown type of shoelace. I don't think I'm gonna use these shoelaces. I'll probably buy some white shoelaces to make it a little bit better. But when I saw them and saw like how the design is on them, I was like, they real clean. I could I could use that, you know what I mean? I could put like a couple of fits together with that, you feel me? So I had to pick these up. When I was making my jewelry video and I had recorded like the ring portion on eBay, um, when I stopped screen recording, I came across this ring right here. Bro, what is that? I need it. You know, I finished recording the video. I purchased the ring. Don't look like the picture though. So that's very like kind of heartbreaking. So like, from the stock photo, it looked really hard. But since I got it in, I don't really like it that much. So so another thing I got, which didn't come in yet. I got it a couple of days ago, um, which is a Christopher Kite's uh, cross chain. I've been wanting this chain for a minute. Uh, when I went to go buy, like originally, it was sold out. And it was sold out in both sizes because I want both sizes. I want the smaller one and I also want the bigger one. Um, but he recently like made a new website and did like a drop. And then when I went to the website, just to see like what he had on there, he had, um, the chain available, you know? So I caught the chain, not waiting for that to come in. And then when that one come in, hopefully like the smaller one available. And then, um, I could purchase that as well. Cause I want to have them stacked up. You know? And last but not least, one of the most exciting things that I'm very excited for. So as you know, I just love like the older like babe stuff. You feel me? Like for real, older like clothing items when it comes to like the BBC ice creams, um, the NERD like collab with like Bape. Um, I have this hat right here. You know, I just got the uh, BBC ice cream shoes uh, that I've been waiting on. But before I had this hat, I had the original one without the logo on top, but I sold it. Um, and that was like a few years ago, but after I sold it, I messaged the dude, I was like, bro, like, if you ever want to sell this hat, you know, I'll buy it back from you, you know, because like, I've been missing that hat ever since I sold it. He was like, nah, I don't think I'm gonna sell it. Some years passed, bro hit me up like a week, like, a, like two weeks ago, like, bro, you still interested in it? I'm like, yes, bro, like, I need that. Without question, you already know what I did. I copped it. <laughs> and I was so happy bro because like this was my original hat and now i have both of them some people don't even have one now i have both of them like come on bro like like this is crazy this is crazy this is this is crazy like bro like i don't <laughs> Like, bro, this is, this is crazy. Like, I have no words for it besides this is crazy. Like, and I ain't even done yet, bro. You already know, every time I acquire any of my grails, I will be making a video on it. You know what I mean? But this, just holding these two in my hand, bro, is just like, it's just beautiful. You know what I mean? So, so that concludes my monthly pickups for August. Um, I have a lot of things that I have to purchase because like, I didn't even purchase like the stuff that I needed for my essentials first. Um, and I know I said I need to work on that, bro, and prioritize like when I'm shopping. But sometimes I be running across things and I'm like, bro, I need that, I gotta get it, you feel me? Because a lot of times this stuff be like, I don't wanna say one of one, but like it's one in that size and like I gotta get it, I can't pass it up, you know? So, but it's definitely like, I still have to buy like a lot of white tees. I need uh, zip up sweaters, you know? But as you see, I am trying to build up my jeans. Um, I have bought some more blue jeans, some darker denim jeans, you know, so. Um, but I really just have to continue to build up my foundation before I'm just like buying like all this random stuff. But like I said, stuff just be popping up like my hat, like, and I'm like, I, I couldn't pass it up. The Dose and Gabbana jeans, I never saw those before. So I had to cop them, you know, so. Um, 
yeah man i hope you enjoyed that video you know you saw something you like you feel me if you have any questions about anything drop it down in the comment section down below you feel me don't forget to like the video and i will see you on the next video you feel me so peace